This is the mosque where the prayer service used to be held a kilometer and a half away from the school, a 20 minute walk. But a former student tells me that once the prayers were moved to their school, it became much easier. The kids, right, they would go to Popeyes and they wouldn't even pray in a mass. So it's obviously better because they're accommodating everyone in the school too. And how long were you out of class for? Oh, we were uh, like 15 minutes. After three years of holding the prayer service, the board has not received a single complaint from a parent at Valley Park. The Canadian Hindu advocacy is the one that raised the issue. And Canada's largest Hindu group, the Canadian Hindu Network, considers their views not representative of mainstream Hindus. I've never heard of this organization. Nobody's ever heard of them. Well, they're, they're saying nobody's ever heard of you. I mean, this, uh, yeah. they're saying that, they're essentially saying that you're the only one behind this organization. Well, okay, you can see, you can look around, you can look they can, around. They hide inside the temple. Yeah. I'm looking they around, but I'm looking around, yeah. but I, I don't see too many Hindus. Oh, don't you? I guess you must be, you must have as no, much honestly, blindness. I'm looking around. Oh, I'm really? Around. Wait yeah. one second. I'll get one. Okay. After a few minutes, he came back with no one. So? So? We've got a few coming. Eighty percent of Valley Park's population is Muslim, also a reflection of Thorncliffe Park, the school's community, and for them, it's about safety. You know this ch the child is going to be safe, you know, because it's going to be in the vicinity of the school. So you know where the child is going to be instead of having the child be outside of school.